spades, would you raise your right hand to be sworn, please? Do you solemnly swear or affirm that the testimony that you will give will be the truth and the whole truth of the Yes. Okay, I'm going to ask you to have a seat and adjust the microphone so you can speak into it. And then I'm going to ask you to state your name and then spell your name for the record, please. Okay. So, uh, Justice Page, spelled uh, J-U-S-T-I-S. And my last name is Page, P-A-I-G-E. Thank you, sir. You may proceed. Thank you, Your Honor. Mr. Page, you're married to Brooke Page. Yes, sir. And how long have you been married? Uh, since October of 2021. And how old are you now? 27. Let me take you to July 19th of 2023. Um, at that time, were you working? Yes, sir. And Mr. Page, where were you working? Simpson Strongta. Full time? Simpson Strongta. Okay. And were you working full time there? Yes, sir. Okay. And do you live here in Baker County? Yes, sir. Do you know a Rhonda Jewell? Yes, sir. Do you see her in the courtroom today? Yes, sir. Can you please point to her and identify what she's wearing? Uh, she has on a uh, black suit with a white shirt. Your Honor, for the record, he's identified the defendant. The record will so reflect that. Thank you, Your Honor. Mr. Page, how do you know the defendant? Um, I knew her through my mother-in-law. So have you known her for a few years? Yes, sir. Let me take you back to July 19th of 2023. At that time, did you and your wife, Brooke Page, did you have any children? Yes. How many children did you have in July of 2023? One child. And was that a boy or girl? Girl. And what was her name? Ariah Page. And in July of 2023, how old was Ariah Page? Uh, she was 10 months old. And if you can briefly describe at 10 months old, what was she able to do at that age? Uh, she, she was sitting up on her own. Um, she was pulling up on things just closely to the point where she was getting ready to walk. Um, she's very energetic and she always had a big smile on her face. Um, anybody that didn't know her, she's given that uh, Wednesday Adams go look, see right through them. Um, she loved just being outside, be with me in the yard, just anything to, just to keep going. At, at that age, was she able to talk at all? Uh, she could baby talk. Baby talk. Okay. On July 19th of 2023, did you work on that day? Yes, sir. Do you remember what the hours were roughly? 8.30 to 5.30. 8.30 to 5.30. So would it be fair to say at 1 p.m. on that day, you were at work? Yes, sir. Did you receive a phone call yes, on sir. that day in the afternoon? Yes, sir. And do you remember who you got the call from? From my dad. After you got the phone call from your dad, did he come to you? Yes, sir. Okay. And what was the purpose of that? Um, he called me and, and told me to be ready when he got to the, uh, there, he was coming to pick me up. Uh, he wouldn't tell me why, um, it was probably about 15 minutes down the road when he told me that, um, Ryan had been left in the vehicle for five hours and still at that point, I didn't, hadn't realized what was really going on. And it was when we got to the hospital that, um, I realized that Raya had passed away. Who is your dad, Mr. Page? Kevin Page. Kevin Page. And what hospital did your dad take you to? Ed Fraser's. When you got to Ed Fraser's, was your wife, Brooke Page, there? Yes, sir. And other family members? Yes, sir. Do you remember if your mom, Pamela Page, was there? Yes, sir, she was there. What was going through your mind when you realized that Raya had passed away? I couldn't really believe it, um, and I just couldn't, 
It took a while before it set in, and I just couldn't believe of how she passed away. Do you remember when you first got there, what you first did when you got to the hospital? Uh, I was looking around and I asked, where's Araya? And um, my mom told me that she had passed away. Were you ever allowed to go see Araya? Yes, sir. And where was that at? Um, it's in a hospital room. She was laying in the bed. And were other family members allowed in there with you? Yes, sir. One moment, Your Honor. Yes. Your Honor, that's all I have. I tender the witness. Thank you, Mr. Page. Uh, well, cross oh, one moment, Mr. Page. Mr. Nelson may have some questions for you. Cross-examination. Good morning, Mr. Page. So sorry for your loss. Normally speaking, you would be gone from the home when Rhonda Jewell picked up your daughter, Araya, correct? Yes, sir. So you don't have any personal knowledge of the events of that morning when Araya was picked up? Personal knowledge? You, didn't, you weren't there? No, I wasn't there. I had uh, just left the house about 7.45. I believe you've known Rhonda Jewell since about 2016 or 17. Does that sound accurate? Yes, sir. Okay. I think you said you knew her and her family through your mother-in-law. Yes, sir. And that would be Monique Carter? Yes, sir. Okay. In that time that you knew Ms. Jewell, you didn't have much contact with her. Is that accurate? Mm, not, not like that. You didn't send her messages on Facebook, you didn't communicate her by social, with her by social media in any way, correct? No, sir. Okay. I believe you may have seen her at family functions of some kind? Yes, sir. They were, uh, she was at your wedding? Yes, sir. Uh, at, uh, she was involved in the birth of your child, is that correct? Okay. Objection, Your Honor, relevance. Overruled. You considered her a close family friend, is that accurate? Yes, sir. Were you, and you were aware that she has provided sitting, babysitting service for other people in the community, correct? Yes, sir. <clears throat> and you knew that she had watched Kaylee and Mike Rogers' daughters, correct? Yes, sir. And you had no reason whatsoever to think that she wouldn't provide excellent care for your daughter? No. Just have just a moment. Have just a moment. Page, you were aware that sometimes Rhonda Jewell would keep a riot over at Stacy's house, correct? Yes, sir. You were also aware that she would sometimes keep your daughter at her home, that is, Rhonda Jewell's home, correct? I don't recall that. Okay. Do you remember the Monday before this? Isn't it accurate to say that Rhonda Jewell had a riot, but not at Stacy's house? Correct. Okay. I have nothing for Mr. Page, Mr. Nelson had mentioned a little while ago about 
the defendant providing excellent care, yes, correct? Sir. Would it be fair to say that the defendant did not provide excellent care to your daughter on July 19th? Yes, sir. Okay. Thank you. Any other questions of this witness? Can he be excused subject to recall? Subject to recall, Your Honor. Okay, sir. Mr. Page, if you'll step down, please. <coughs> Would you call your next witness, please? Yes, Your Honor. Next will be Pamela Page. Can I have one moment, Your Honor? Yep. Just one moment, Your Honor. Your Honor, the state's next witness will be Nevaeh Carter. Nevaeh Carter. Okay. 